Friedrich Wilhelm Ostwald, the 2nd of September 1853 to the 4th of April 1932, was a German chemist. He received the Nobel Prize in Chemistry in 1909 for his work on catalysis, chemical equilibria and reaction velocities. Ostwald, Jacobus Henricus van T. Hoff, Walther Nernst, and Svante Arrhenius are usually credited with being the modern founders of the field of physical chemistry. Early life and education Ostwald was born ethnically Baltic German in Riga, to Master Cooper Gottfried Wilhelm Ostwald (1824–1903) and Elizabeth Lukel (1824–1903). He was the middle child of three, born after Eugen (1851–1932) and before Gottfried (1855–1918). Ostwald graduated from the University of Tartu, Estonia, then Dorpat in 1875, received his Ph.D. there in 1878 under the guidance of Carl Schmidt, and taught at Co-Arc from 1875 to 1881 and at Riga Polytechnicum from 1881 to 1887. <laughs> Work Ostwald is usually credited with inventing the Ostwald process patent 1902, used in the manufacture of nitric acid, although the basic chemistry had been patented some 64 years earlier by Kuhlmann, when it was probably of only academic interest due to the lack of a significant source of ammonia. That may have still been the state of affairs in 1902, although things were due to change dramatically in the second half of the decade as a result of Haber and Bosch's work on their nitrogen fixing process completed by 1911 or 1913. The date 1908, 6 years after the patent, is often given for the invention of the Ostwald process, and it may be that these developments motivated him to do additional work to commercialize the process in that time frame. Alternatively, six years might simply have been the bureaucratic interval between filing the patent and the time it was granted. The combination of these two breakthroughs soon led to more economical and larger-scale production of fertilizers and explosives, of which Germany was to find itself in desperate need during World War I. Ostwald also did significant work on dilution theory leading to his discovery of the law of dilution which is named after him. Ostwald's rule concerns the behavior of polymorphs. The word mole, according to Gorin, was introduced into chemistry around 1900 by Ostwald. Ostwald defined one mole as the molecular weight of a substance in mass grams. The concept was linked to the ideal gas, according to Ostwald. Ironically, Ostwald's development of the mole concept was directly related to his philosophical opposition to the atomic theory, against which he along with Ernst Mach, was one of the last holdouts. He explained in a conversation with Arnold Sommerfeld that he was converted by Jean Perrin's experiments on Brownian motion. In 1906, Ostwald was elected a member of the International Committee on Atomic Weights. As a consequence of World War I, this membership ended in 1917 and was not resumed after the war. The 1917 annual report of the committee ended with the unusual note Because of the European War, the committee has had much difficulty in the way of correspondence. The German member, Professor Ostwald, has not been heard from in connection with this report. Possibly the censorship of letters, either in Germany or en route, has led to a miscarriage. In addition to his work in chemistry, Wilhelm Ostwald was very productive in an extremely broad range of fields. His published work, which includes numerous philosophical writings, contains about 40,000 pages. Ostwald was also engaged in the peace movement of Berta von Suttner. Among his other interests, Ostwald was a passionate amateur painter who made his own pigments, and who developed a strong interest in color theory in the later decades of his life. He wrote several publications in the field, such as his Malabrief Letters to a Painter, 1904 and Die Farbenfibel The Color Primer, 1916. His work in color theory was influenced by that of Albert Henry Munsell, and in turn influenced Paul Klee and members of Distigil, including Piet Mondrian. He was also interested in the international language movement, first learning Esperanto, then later supporting Edo and had become member of Committee of the Delegation for the Adoption of an International Auxiliary Language. Ostwald donated half the proceedings of his 1909 Nobel Prize to the Edo movement, funding the Edo magazine Progresso which he had proposed in 1908. Ostwald adopted the philosophy of monism as advanced by Ernst Haeckel and became president of the Monistic Alliance in 1911. 
He used the Alliance's forum to promote social Darwinism, eugenics and euthanasia. Ostwald's monism influenced Carl G. Jung's identification of psychological types. He was one of the directors of the Die Bruck Institute in Munich. The institute was sponsored, significantly, from Ostwald's Nobel Prize money. Topic. Awards Nobel Prize in Chemistry, 1909 Wilhelm Exner Medal, 1923 Topic. Personal life On 24 April 1880 Ostwald married Helena von Reher with whom he had five children Greta born 1882 in Riga, died 1960 in Grabathen Wolfgang born 1883 in Riga, died 1943 in Dresden Elizabeth born 1884 in Riga, died 1968 in Grabathen Walter born 1886 in Riga, died 1958 in Freiburg im Breisgau Karl Otto born 1890 in Leipzig, died 1958 in Leipzig Ostwald was initiated to the Scottish Rite Masonry and became Grand Master of the Grand Lodge Zur Aufgehenden Zana, in Bayreuth. In 1887, he moved to Leipzig where he worked for the rest of his life. Arthur Noyes was one of his students, as was Willis Rodney Whitney. On his religious views, Ostwald was an atheist. Ostwald died in a hospital in Leipzig on 4 April 1932, and was buried at his house in Grabathen, near Leipzig and then in the Great Cemetery of Riga. In fiction He appears as a character in Joseph Skibble's 2010 novel, A Curable Romantic. Ostwald is also mentioned in Italo Svivo's 1923 novel, Zeno's Conscience. Topic. Publications Ostwald, W. 1900. Grundriss der Allgemeinen Chemie. Leipzig, Engelmann. Ostwald, W. 1906. Process of Manufacturing Nitric Acid. Patent. Ostwald, W. 1909. Energetische Grundlagen der Kulturwissenschaft. First ed. Leipzig. Kucherit, L., Jespersen O., Lorenz R., Ostwald W., Foundler L. 1910. International Language and Science – Considerations on the Introduction of an International Language into Science. London, Constable and Company Limited. Ostwald, W. 1917. Grundriss der Allgemeinen Chemie 5th ed. Dresden, Steinkopf. Topic. Works. Leitlinien der Chemie, 7 Gemeinverstandliche Vorträge aus der Geschichte der Chemie. Leipzig, a.k.a.d. Verl, Jess, 1906. Digital edition of the University and State Library Dusseldorf. Topic. See also Ostwald color system Ostwald dilution law Ostwald's rule Ostwald ripening Power law fluid Timeline of hydrogen technologies List of Baltic German scientists Topic. Notes Topic. References Clark, F. W. Annual Report of the International Committee on Atomic Weights. J. M. Chem. SOC, 38 11, 2219-2221. 10.1021, YA 0226AO01. Gorin, G. 1994. Mole and Chemical Amount, A Discussion of the Fundamental Measurements of Chemistry. J. Chem. EDUC. 71 2, 114. Bibcode, 1994 J. Ched, 0.71, 114G. Doi 10.1021 ed 071p114. Patrick Coffey, Cathedrals of Science: The Personalities and Rivalries That Made Modern Chemistry. Oxford University Press, 2008. ISBN 9780195321340.
Topic. External links Nobel Lecture on Catalysis from NobelPrize.org website Biography Biography from NobelPrize.org website Works by Wilhelm Ostwald at Project Gutenberg Works by or about Wilhelm Ostwald at Internet Archive Works by Wilhelm Ostwald at LibriVox Public Domain Audiobooks The Origin of the Word Mole at the Wayback Machine archived the 22nd of December 2007 Chemteam Lancet's Energy Grossbothen, Saxony Ostwald and his country seat Energy in English History of the International Committee on Atomic Weights Newspaper clippings about Wilhelm Ostwald in the 20th century press archives of the German National Library of Economics ZBW